All right, so where we left off last, if you don't remember, yesterday we um, we took down the second crystal. Blacksmith's blues? What does that even mean? We took down the second crystal. Have fun. Thanks for lurking. Is it true what I'm hearing, Sid? So now we have three more crystals to get. Sail all the way to the shore. What up, la 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 but the rest is up to you. You need to start taking better care of yourself. You're eh? Let's make you more than eh. Whoa! Understood. And thank you. Got boobies. <sighs> Brotato? Yeah, I've been playing Brotato. On the Let's Play channel if you want to watch. Has spread. Make sure she rests. Hey, throat. Hope you're doing good. <clears throat> If it hurts, you can tell me, you know. I'll understand. I can bear it. But you shouldn't have to. Not anymore. This isn't just your struggle, Clive. It's ours. And when we see how hard you fight, it inspires us to do the same. Oh. Hey, Matthew. Would you rather we left you to save the world or Good morning. Own? No. That's not. Ignore me. Whoa. They're not going to kiss. Someone's going to interrupt them. Clive, where are you? See? In here. What's wrong? Those areas under attack. What? Hand holding in this game? More likely than you think. The army we're talking about. It's the men of the rock from Drake's Fang. Hugo Kupka's private guard. Oh, Kupka's. There is in hell in Rosalith. Trying to batter down the castle gates. Looking for me. Seems that way. Reckon old Hugo has finally worked out who Sid really is. Then this is just another trap. It's a trap, all right. The daddy of all fucking traps. I'm going to Rosaleth. You're not serious. That's exactly what he wants you to do, Clive. Look, I don't know why Kupka harbors such a grudge against Sid. But as long as it's left to fester, our world will never know peace. He has dragged the rest of Storm into this pointless war just to find me. Beside which, I am not about to stand and watch while my home gets ground into the dirt. They also have some sex scenes in here, Max. Hugo Kuka must die. I have lost enough friends to that man already. I don't want to lose any more. So let's go and kill the bastard. I'm coming too. No, you're not. After all, we're in this together. All right. I guess she is coming. All righty. So our next quest is to kill Hugo Kuko. But I wonder... We need to know what we're getting ourselves into. I thought he was going to be like the final boss, you know, the big bad kahuna. 
that you kill last but maybe it's your mom that you actually kill last if you haven't been paying attention to the story your mom in this game is very evil and uh this has no regard for human life like lebron james so i wonder if I was thinking Koopko would be the last one we killed, but maybe uh, the story's like, maybe we have a, like another downfall where it's like, oh, we're about to die. Oh no, Five's dead. Oh no, he's not actually dead though. He's more than alive. Gov gave you the news then. We're leaving for Rosalith, but not before I know exactly what's going on. What have we heard? All sorts. Nobody was expecting the Delmax to open up a new front against the Empire, least of all our friends in the provinces. Reports have been rolling in from all over the place, with no two saying the same thing. I've been passing them on to Vivian, in the hope she can make sense of them. If you're set on going, you'll want to talk to her. Understood. Your greatest Final Fantasy villain, Sephiroth Kefka, your mother. Direct nerd. If it isn't my favorite pupil. Hi, Vivian. Let's see now, where did we leave? Well, this is a surprise. My lectures are rarely so well attended. Uh, you know what they say? A little knowledge uh, can't hurt. We are going to Rosalith to deal with Kupka. What's the situation there? <laughs> Whoa there, Lord Rossfield. I'm sure you're champing at the bit to return to your roost, but to fully understand the present situation, one must first understand how it came to be. Ugh, oh, goodness gracious, we're about to have a history lesson. Get your notepads out. Early morning notes. Let us begin with the story of Hugo Kupka. Thanos. Or the permanent economic advisor to the Dalmekian government, to give him his formal title. In a republic founded on commerce, there could hardly be a more influential position. It has granted him both extraordinary wealth and extraordinary Oh my crash god! I'm pretty up! Happy matter. Sunday, Burr. I love you, dominant, sleep a lot. He's also Dalmechia's last line of defense. A fact he has used to his considerable Give me a second. advantage. Why, he was even able to pry Drake's fang, one of the pillars of the republic from parliament's grip. And he was quick to buy the loyalty of the Fang's protectors. Today they are his faithful creatures. Give me one second. A private army in all but name. The self-same army that marches upon Rosarian soil as we speak. By which I mean Imperial soil. Not that you need reminding of the fact. Suffice it to say, the Empire's attentions are elsewhere at present. Deadlocked as it is with Dalmechia over its occupation of the Crystalline Dominion where its legions are now gathered. Scarcely a handful of garrisons remain to secure its western provinces, and half of them left after the fall of Drake's He's breath. He's an economic advisor, a permanent one. Iron blood thus diminished, they had little cause to fear a maritime invasion. And so today, only a token force guards the former duchy's shores, as Kupka was quick to descry. He landed his troops on the Rosarian coast without encountering so much as a single ship. All for you, Clive. He wants your head. And so he and his men advance upon Rosalith, not to capture the province, but to draw you out. Lane, thanks for the tier three for 31 months. Love you too. Hope you're doing good. Get ready for a fun day of movies. You said Kupka's forces sailed up the coast. What of Port Isolde, then? Is the city safe? Quite, according to the Guardians of the Flame. The Dalmechian fleet floated by without incident. But not without remark. When they learned Kupka's forces were making for Rosalith, our friends were quick to begin arranging the exodus of her citizens. And so the stage will soon be set for your heroic homecoming. Alas. It will be a more trying task to enter the <clears throat> capital than it was to leave it. Hugo's men hold Buett Bridge, despite the Imperials' repeated attempts to wrest it back from their grasp. And they were careful not to repeat the Empire's mistake in neglecting their coastal defenses. The seas around Rosalith are firmly under Dalmechian control. So tell me, pupil mine, what do you believe to be the best route to Rosalith? 
the north. They cross the northern border near Phoenix Gate, then take the road through Stillwind down to the capital. Hardly the quickest route, but at least we won't be spotted. A little local knowledge goes a long way, and so must you. We'd best get a move on, then. Oh. Will you be going, too? I? I've been waiting a long time to give that fucker a taste of his own medicine. I would have missed this for the world. He's dying. All right. We should be on our way. Lead on. For people that don't know, Koopka wants to kill uh, Clive because Clive is pretending to be Sid. And Sid delivered Koopka's lover's head to him. Benedicta's head to him. So, Koopka thinking Clive is Sid because he's going under the name Sid because they don't want people to know Sid's dead because Sid's a dominant. Um, he wants to kill. He wants to kill him. So he's drawing him out by attacking his home. But I feel like a lot of people do realize Sid's kind of dead. There's a lot of side quests now. Should I do one? Either way, he he probably assumes that Sid, Clive, sent them Benedicta's head, not the Sid that we knew and loved. The one that sadly died. Alright, let's go to Rosalith's castle. Let's let's go! Also, hey, Avatar. The Imperial Province of Rosaria. Fortify the castle gates at once. There we are. Hugo and his men have been busy. We've already breached the castle's outer wall. Hey, Jean. The Imperials are holding the ground for now, but it's only a matter of time before the keep falls. Those fuckers really went to town on this place. Almost like they want to wipe it off the map. Just a means to an end. It's like three versus like. 87. All this for one man? They didn't have to go so far. If you keep your wits about you, I reckon you can make it up to the castle without raising the alarm. Morning, Gamer Pro. Sniff out any townsfolk who haven't escaped yet and send them on the way. Be careful. Likewise. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Morning, morning, morning. Hope you're well. Sprained your foot. That's not good. Well, that's not good. <laughs> Gavizaro? Who? Zaro. I know. It's like a nightmare. This was our home. Oh, Zoro? Come on, Clive. We have to keep going. The same like voice actor as the English version of Zoro. Oh, the eye scar. <laughs> I was gonna say, wow, this 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 actor has a lot of range. <laughs> He can he can turn on the British just in a, in a heartbeat. <laughs> this isn't an invasion. It's a massacre. He'll stop at nothing, Clive. Nothing. I'm gonna say, God damn. Do this. 
Because he wants to kill you. He wants vengeance for his dead lover. That's why. We can get through here. Oh, that's convenient. That Gav. Some opponents will protect cast spells to raise defensive barrier around their allies that shields them from melee attacks when engaged in protected targets. Identified by uh, avoid using your sword instead of playing magic to really efficient their dispel barrier. Well, they're close to my level. How is God of Fantasy War? Happy Sunday, sleepy flower, sleepy lover. Not good gamer, thank you for the tier two for 30 months. Big love in the chapter, not good. Tier two, 30 months is huge. It is very good. What's up, weird? How are you doing? I haven't done a lot of side quests, but I'm also kind of just invested in the main story right now. And I hope you guys can understand why I'm mostly invested in the main story right now. Happy Sunday. Do I have enough points yet for 15 points away from Flames of Rebirth? I yield, I yield. That sounds like Sid. Gentlemen. That guy kind of sounded like Sid. Oh, nice job. <gasps> I can afford it now. The flames of rebirth. Everything costs so much. I probably would have a lot more if I didn't... Uh... Well, I have a lot of stuff that I don't use. I'd probably have a lot more if I did uh, more cutscenes and whatnot. Or more side quests, but you know, whatever. when I just got paid. Oh my god, I can afford stuff. Oh, now I can't. Now I'm poor. Oh my god, I can afford it. And now I have nothing. You ever get drunk and buy rollerblades? I have. Holy shit. That has a long cooldown. Oh, I forgot to buy potions. I forgot to buy potions, man. You ever had your foot tilt at a weird angle for no reason? Yeah, I've sprained my ankle before. You can refund from skills you don't use anymore? Oh yeah, you can do that. But then don't you have to refund everything? I guess that's one day. That's one way to... That's probably the only way to keep all the skills. Thanks for letting me get up. That's very kind of you. Yeah! 
staggered. I have low health. Holy shit. God damn, dude, he took so much damn damage. I will say, there are some enemies that do feel like a bullet sponge. Or I guess in this case, a sword sponge. They take so much damn damage. Why is the FPS so bad here? I have never had any FPS problems with this game until right now. I am in a hot room, so maybe the PS5 is overheating. Maybe you can't handle all the action. Three bloody hides, hey, crits again. More enemies. Hey, fellas. That is an insane move. That is just an insane move. The freaking rebirth. Holy shit. Where do we go now? Or is this just an optional area that I went to? No, never mind. We're going right here. I feel like it's not going to end there. It's not going to be that simple to kill Kup Kupka. I feel like it's not going to be that simple to kill that guy, you know? The wall of lightning pile drive. We got all these people just waiting for us. Turn off this auto lock? God damn. We have to kill this guy first because he's the one that's given everybody goddamn shields. Giving them goddamn shields still. I'll just kill them all with this. Holy shit. I got us half our goddamn level up. Set her loose. Oh, jeez, of course. A giant tiger. Or a coral. Whatever the hell that thing's called. 
Oh my god. Torgal, you might be a little smaller than this thing. Attack. Ready. What do you think? You want to pet it, Gabby? This is how you die. So be careful. You know what? Screw it. You'd be okay going out that way? Y'all are crazy. Y'all look crazy. Let's get it. We didn't do any damage to it. Also, hi, Gabby. I didn't say hello. What kind of streamer is this? Well, that didn't do any damage. Kitty cat. Am I, I might die here. What's up, Gemini? How are you doing? It's over. Dying is for skill issue gamers, not birth. This is true. I didn't die like I thought I might have. I didn't die. I got a coral whisker, which means I can craft something. Stormy wakes me up at 530 and it's horrible. She's such an asshole. Oh no. Meet at last, yeah, we knew something was gonna happen. Or should I say Lord Rosfield? I've been looking for you for a very long time. 
Let her go, Kuka. I'm so glad you accepted my invitation. I went to some trouble with the decorations. <laughs> Do you like what I've done with the place? Bastard. <laughs> Such a pity your predecessor couldn't join us. But I am sure you will prove compelling company. Be still, little snowflake. I would not have you melt before your starring moment. This dude gives me Thanos vibes. I knew this was going to happen. We weren't going to kill him. Hey, Daystress. Yeah, all the characters are smoking hot. Now, on to the festive. You know what they say? Sexy sells. Game wouldn't sell as much if Clive looked like me. They didn't get Torkoal. What about Torkoal? Uh, that's just great, that is. Got the beard? This is true. It's up to me, then. Me and Clive do have a similar beard. All right, Gav, save us. How long does the bit goal go? Until I get depressed and I'm like, uh, let's not have this anymore. So it could be here for a while. Could not be here for a while. Hedgeman! I look skinnier from the last time I saw you. I mean, maybe I haven't been eating a lot. Uh, Where do you I haven't worked out in a month, though. Could be the angle. You, bring the prisoner. We're gonna do like a Roman duel. Yes, no more than she deserves for getting into bed with an outlaw. Whoa! We should get into mine. Whoa! Lord Kupka commands your presence. You're to bear witness to the girl's execution. Such a waste. <laughs> All right, Gav. Out of nowhere. Gav. Crystal fetters are a bastard to open, just so you know. Don't worry, I'll have them off before you can blink. Where is Jill? In the courtyard. Shit. Final Fantasy is not usually this graphic. We have to hurry. The Imperials have sounded the retreat and cleared out of the castle. But the place is still swarming with Kuka's men. Leave them to me. I'll make my way up top and circle round the back. Quick as you like, eh? Ah. Nearly forgot. Hold on, Jill. I'm coming. All right, let's save Jill. We kind of saw this coming. I saw this coming from my way. You should avoid spoilers so this comes out on PC. I will hate to say it to you. It might take a while. I hope it doesn't, but it might take a while. How long do PlayStation games usually take to come on PC? I'm still waiting for Ghost of Tsushima to come on PC, because that's a game I want to play. But maybe I'll just buy it on PlayStation. 
F15 took like, three years. Three years? Not bad. God of War 2018, like four years? God damn. Maybe this one won't take as long because they're more... Because they want to, uh... They want to get them on PC as fast as possible. You know? Ghost of Tsushima is amazing. It's a game that I've always wanted to try. But it's like, I feel like it'd be like this game on stream. But I definitely want to try it. It looks very good. Combat looks incredible. Okay, what do you guys think? Do they kill Jill? I don't think they do. I hope you've got a plan, Clive, because we are fucked if you don't. Probably not a good stream game. Yeah, wait till I have like 3,000 viewers doing anything, Devil, and we'll be good to go. You know? Ragnarok will come to PC. I will say... If you're buying a console for exclusives, you gotta buy PlayStation. Because PlayStation actually has exclusives that are good. Xbox, you can get everything on PC. Which is cool. This guy was gonna miss the execution. Jill, can you stand? Good boy, Torgo. We we did. We got to give you all the pets after this one. Don't tell me you tire of my entertainment. Enough. Yes. Perhaps it is time we served the main repast. I trust you are hungry. We didn't kill any of them. Need this. Much obliged. Stay close. We're getting out of here. And Torgo, thank you. Gotta thank Torgal. Dude, that move is insane. Holy shit, this guy is pissed. Why are we asking if Jill can fight now when the fight is already happening? I feel like we're gonna lose somebody here. I really hope we don't lose Gav, though. I've liked having Gav. Gav's been kind of the unsung hero of this entire game the entire time, and no one has really mentioned it. So I'm gonna mention it. Gav has kind of carried us. the real main character like he has kind of saved our ass multiple times throughout this playthrough all right there we go So unnecessary.
only did 9,000 damage to him. this really good tendency of taking a lot of damage out of nowhere in this game. Back in my day when an attack did 65,000 damage, that meant something. On this game, 65,000 damage is tickle damage. Because they all have so much goddamn health. You got Waka from FFX to 9999 damage repeatedly 10 times. That's who the guy's name is in FFX. Fucking Waka, the dude with the crazy hair. And he's buffed and he plays that stupid game that you have to play. Blitzball or something? Is that what it's called? Blitzball? God, that shit was horrible. <laughs> it's over. And he's racist. Oh my god. I bet that wasn't the last of him. I did forget that. I played the game for 13 hours. Until Coop is dead. So you get in there and finish the job, eh? Go on. If they come again, we'll hold them back. All right. But be careful. Oh, I get to fight him? Wait, can I pet freaking the dog seven times for saving us? Wait, 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 wait. I can't pet Torgal because he's in chaos mode. But Torgal, we're besties. Torgal. I need to get rid of one of these moves. Okay, wait a minute. One of these moves puts down like this weird thing that I hate. I'm pretty sure it's this one. I'm gonna put on Thunderstorm. Five hundred twenty one. Can I upgrade anything? I'm four away from upgrading lightning rod. Lovely. I could upgrade my precision dodge. Let's actually do that. Let me master precision dodge. You can pet the dog in this game, too. You can pet Torkoal. Just not right now. Lightning Rod's the one I hate. Oh, let's upgrade it. Damn. Make it feel good about itself for being so useless. You'll die by my hand. Dude, I got two potions. Maybe they're going to give me more because it's like, yo, dude, you need po Oh, my God. They're giving me potions. All right. I got five potions. Abstract O W, what up, stonkers? How you doing? Abstract, you ever just play a single player game that is absolutely horrible for your stream, but you tell yourself you can make content on it outside of your stream, so you just keep on doing it? Because it's also very fun. You're late. Trouble on the way. Never. Just enjoying your entertainment. <laughs> How gratifying. I'm engrossed in this story, though. So I need to beat it. But it's so bad for my stream, but I need to beat it. To defend your father's throne, Lord Rosfield. Also hope you're well. Love you, King. <laughs> the Grand Duchy of Rosaria. A realm without a ruler. An army 
even a people, a veritable kingdom of dust. Plenty of trip to Canada coming to Alberta. Alberta. Truly, I see no throne to defend. Shut up, Thanos. Oh. No. I wish I was still there so I could go to Niagara with you. Enough of your games, Kuka. Just tell me what you want. He wants your head. Sit's head in a box. Mm-hmm. Imagine my disappointment when I learned that he met his end at the hand of another. And my relief to learn that you had taken up his thrice damned name. Are they gonna show the head in the box though? Use that M Raiden? Master slew Benedicta Harmon and defiled her body. What's in that bar? Wow, that is really a reference to Seven Deadly Sins. Name, then you shall answer for his crimes. A head in a box. The only crimes I shall answer for are my own. So did movie? Oh yeah, I agree. It is power to save that woman, though she was long past saving. Oh. And so I did what he couldn't. It was me all along, Hugo. It was you. You. You killed her. Mm -hmm. I did. And I'll do it again. What's in the box? What's in the box? <laughs> I should probably hold the controller. Fortunate indeed. I had thought the most I could wish for was to take the life of one he loved, just as he did to me. But it seems I was wrong. And I shall have my revenge. We shared a dream. I would be the king of the world. She would be my queen. And together, we would rule like the gods we are. But you crushed that dream, ground it into dust. Hail Mary, rise for you. You will pay. For what you've done, I'll tear you apart with my hands. And what of you? How many people have you killed? How many dreams have you crushed? You're not the only one who's seen their world fall apart around them. Thank God they let each other talk instead of killing each other. You'll get no pity from me, Kuka. No pity and no mercy. Five's voice actor really just kind of like stepped it up.
I think he will steal Titan. Hundred percent, he steals it. It doesn't seem like they're content on one of them, on both of them coming out of this alive. Accidentally healed. Fuck, I thought I had thought I had Torgo with me. Oh. We're about to get hit. We have to have our bad moment in the fight. You're surprised that he can lift up a floor? You're getting kind of fucked. He's getting kind of destroyed by me. Dude, I couldn't even get out of that.
Hugo's like that that elite four member who's supposed to be like rock type, but then like has like an infernape. It's supposed to be fire type, and then they have like a Steelix. Just notice the big gold. Do you like it? You must feel pretty bad to lose a fight this badly when you have so much more health than me. You know what I mean? Oh, good timing on the stagger. XP Earth Shard. All right, now it's time for Titan. I assume it's time for Titan. Oh, 
Oh, come on. I'm kicking his ass. Oh my god. How did I not do that before? He's not done. He's not done. Son of a whore. I just steal Titan from him? Did that just crush him? Oh no, he's still going. What hands? There, there. You mustn't get yourself worked up. Wait. Who the fuck is that? Another time, Mythos. That might be the prince. Is that all of them? I think so. Well, Ludus, scum. Who the fuck invited them? Not that that's the biggest surprise we've had to do. Where did you learn to do that toggle? Not telling, eh? Suit yourself. Gav, we have to find Clive. Right, sorry. He'll be walking out right as you're walking in. Oh, never mind. You missed one. We were worried. So was I. So close. If it hadn't been for my gift, I would have finished him. I'm just glad you got out of there alive. When did the royalists arrive? Right after you went inside. The Kupka's alive. Just it when we thought we were shot of Titans, lot. In pile Odins. Not enough of them to worry us, though. You didn't see the one who took Kukra away. So, what? You think they came here to save him? Well, I'll be fucked if I know what's going on, but every minute we spend racking our brains, that bastard's getting further away. So what do we do? We go back. We go back to the hideaway. I'm too tired to think. As are you, by the looks of it. And after what Jill's been through. Let's worry about Kupka later, shall we? Aye. All right. Well, give us a chance to solve the riddle of your magic mud, too. Hey, 
Hey, how you feeling? Ready to go home? He could be Canadian. He could be British. He could be my friend. We could all use a friend like Gav. Gets you out of prison, saves your life, loses an eye in your honor. Murders the Imperials with you. What more could you ask for in a friend? Trophy earned, Twilight Rose. Alright, let's finish this mission off by returning to the hideaway. God, Iris Twang, hey, he's got some Irish in him. Just look at the state of you. You're more of a wreck than this place. Is this what you call taking better care of yourself? No more excuses, your ladyship. I order you to rest. <sighs> Fine. I'll rest. Don't worry, Gav. She's in good hands. Look, we should have never let her fall into Hugo's. Back when he had some like. <laughs> the question is, where is he now? And what the hell were those royalists doing there? Hmm. I was wondering about that all the way home. Otto may have heard something. I'll talk to him. And I'll talk to Tomes. The Lawsman? About what? About your faithful hound for a start. <coughs> if any four-legged friends ever done that before, I'm betting Tomes will have read about it. But what I want to know is, what happens afterwards? It's all well and good Toggle saving our asses, but if it costs him what it costs Jill... Right. Let me know if you learn anything. He doesn't even know about his magic hound! Did you do the same, eh? Jill. Tombs. Listen to Taya. I will. Thank you. Bolts from the blue. A like and subscribe, YouTube. There's a lot of Final Fantasy. Clive has claimed a portion of the icon's Titan essence. Attuning with Titan not only changes the elemental aspect of Clive's magic spells, but also allows access to several new iconic abilities, such as Wind Up, a singular strike that increases in potency when charged. Oh, we did get a new. We did get a new feat.